Hi folks, this is the chapel near the Echo Hut. We just came with Stasi and uh, you can see in on a what specific spot actually the hut is and um, this is amazing they call it the the iron gates the iron gates uh, locality of the mountain uh, and I'm interested I will ask later on the the housekeeper of the hut because we got interested why is it called the iron gates we believe with Stasi maybe on this uh, peak there in ancient times during the Trachan tribes times probably there were some fortifications there or some kind of small fort or castle uh, it's gonna be interesting to uh, to find more about it and you can see now this is the area of Vratza town in Bulgaria over there where what you see are the Vratza rocks the very well known um, tourist side things the Vratza rocks you can see I, can, I will zoom a little bit over there in the middle of the screen you can see these uh, rock walls and the uh, rock formations the, over there is uh, the lower part of Balkan mountain uh, it's a lot lower there compared to the highest pe peaks here which are up to 2000 and 300 meters above the sea level and uh, check this amazing view and the job and Stasi is making pictures and videos and this is the, the fist the so called the fist uh, Peak, Yumruka Peak in Bulgarian means the fist peak. Uh, over there, I told you in the previous video, is Kamenica Peak in the fog, and behind Kamenica is Vezhen Peak. And um, as you see, that this is one of the most uh, interesting parts of uh, Balkan Mountain in Bulgaria. The Balkan Mountain is in the middle of Bulgaria. And it's a narrow and very long mountain that stretches from one end of Bulgaria that even she starts from the territory of uh, Serbia. And the mountain stretches from Serbia to the east up to the Black Sea seashore where the end of the mountain is already very, very low. And the mountain ends in the Emine. Uh, locality there is the the most uh, east part of Bulgarian territory is Emine so it's amazing story for this mountain and the chapel is absolutely amazing design I want to cross my oh man Jesus it's lovely creation by human hands amazing design and the glass you see the glass here it's absolutely amazing the colorful glass and we can see the other window from the other side through this glass oh it's a little bit coldish a little bit wind because uh, some clouds appeared see this other window just amazing Which, which go 
goes down to the forest. Da, da, aš, aš gledam, aš nov, nov, nekaj, da, aš gledam tako, da kamera ta nije zgleda. And, da, uh, <coughs> Stasi just warned me, be careful, because it is, uh, Dangerous here, although it's not super steep. There are some meadows and uh, bushes and here and there, so yeah, it's not uh, that dangerous on this spot specifically. But over there, you will be a little bit dangerous if you go up to the edge. And uh, uh, what you see over there is a cosetus in a hut from which we passed and uh, yesterday we were here on do you see this arch this is the arch of freedom on the Beclemeto peak and we started from there yesterday then passed through the Cosa Tostena hut over there uh, but it was very very foggy that's why the previous videos from this series of videos are mostly some of them are foggy which were from yesterday when we were passing through all this is considered uh, a little bit dangerous path on this amazing mountain ridge one of the most beautiful mountain ridges I have ever seen but today with Stasi we'll be able to make more videos and uh, pictures because yesterday was very foggy as I told you Today is absolutely amazing. We can see, every, see everything, all the ridges of the mountain, all the parts of it, and the sunshine is making good view today. So please follow our next uh, episodes to see our trip back to the Peklemeto Peak and the Arch of Freedom, that is a monument from the communist time of Bulgaria. So please watch our next video, please subscribe and uh, like this video if you like this uh, content and comment below what you think about uh, Echo Hut uh, and about the area of the Balkan mountain we are now here. I think this is one of my top five places I have ever been on earth, one of the best spots in mountains I have ever been definitely top five for me guys and thank you for watching and for subscribing uh, for all to all of you who support the channel and uh, see you in the next videos bye bye guys